So when you think of autumn, think New England. We are at Randall's farm and we are going to do a taste test. Taste test. Ice cream. Yes. There are so many farms in New England like this that are filled with haunted happenings. Very cute. Wow. That's a lot. Wait. Okay, what is that? Apple cider. Yes. Freshly made. Freshly made. Covered with cinnamon sugar. <laughs> bad. Very bad. Oh man. So is that worth going vegetarian for for a day? Yes. Oh, give me some of that. <laughs> so this is. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Oh sure, she's gonna eat it all now. Yes. It's worth going vegetarian for a day for this donut. Hundred <laughs> percent. Now we're trying this. It's part of Randall's farm. It's called Elsie's Creamery. And they're gonna be closing in two weeks, so we're getting our ice cream now. Here's some fall flavors. We're not going vegetarian for those though. We are taste testing the vegan ice cream. Mm -hmm. You know, it's really good, obviously. Oh, it's good ice cream, yeah. Yeah. The top ice cream. Ah! <laughs> Fucker nutter. <laughs> mm. Okay. Chocolate cookie dough is the top scoop. And if we ever see the bottom scoop, it's chocolate. <laughs> it's supposed to be chocolate. Obviously, the portion is stupid. This is just two scoops. Two scoops. $9.10. $9.10. The vegan ice. selection is $2 more than the regular ice cream. I'm going to dig on the side here. Okay. Chocolate has been revealed. Mm. Mm. That chocolate's good. It's mm. delicious. <laughs> Isn't it like, um, it's like Ben and Jerry's. If you're from Massachusetts, Randall's Farm has really good vegan ice cream, chocolate ice cream, and worth going vegetarian for mm. apple cider donuts. Mm -hmm. See you soon. Oh, bye. bye. We're never going to finish this. Mm -hmm. <laughs>